Yeah, what's poppin' loyalists? Welcome back to the channel. This is Dom ZNT, aka Glitch Guru. In this GTA 5 online video, I'm gonna be showing you guys the brand new gift cards to friends glitch workaround. This is a brand new method, so shout out to the founder of this glitch, Bro Tango. I will leave a link to his channel down in the description below so you guys can go check him out. All right, let's get started with this glitch. The very first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna start up an invite only session and we're gonna invite our friend to the session. Next, we're gonna come over here to the casino and we're gonna call out our MOC. And now we're gonna make sure that we have personal vehicle storage for our MOC and we're gonna store either a Fagio or a LG RH8 in the back of our MOC or a vehicle that we do not want any longer because it will get replaced. Also, you wanna start this glitch off in free aim because we will need to join people who are in a different targeting mode multiple times during this glitch. And one other piece of information, throughout this video, I will be going back and forth between my perspective and my friend's perspective. So everything that the helper has to do, I will have in black and white. And everything the person receiving the vehicle has to do will be in color, which is the main footage here. So let's get started. So we have our friend in the vehicle with us. And what we're going to do is we're going to pull up to where the garage is. And before we get that alert, we're going to have our friend press start. And he's going to go over to the PlayStation Store and he's just going to hover over PlayStation Store, okay? He's not going to select it. He's just going to hover over the PlayStation Store. Now, what we're going to do while our friend is hovering over the PlayStation Store is we're going to pull up to the parking garage and we're just going to wait here for a second. And there's a little bit of timing involved. So we want to both select X at the same time. So I'm going to select parking garage and my friend is going to select to go into the PlayStation Store at the same time. So on the count of three, we'll both do that. One, two, three. I'm going to select parking garage. He's going to select to go into the PlayStation store. And if done correctly, we should load into the parking garage without our friend and our friend should be outside. And he just want to wait on the screen that he's on until we get outside with the vehicle. That's very important. So once we spawn out of the parking garage with this vehicle, then we want to tell our friend to back out of the menu, back out of those screens, and he should have an infinite black loading screen. Okay, so this is my friend's perspective. He's just now backing out of the PlayStation Store and he now has an infinite black loading screen. So what he's going to do is join somebody in a different targeting mode. He's going to do the double join method and he's just going to decline that second alert message. All right. So after declining that second alert message, he is now off the radar. His mini map should be glitched out as well. If your friend got pulled into the garage with you, then you want to do that step over. Or if your friend didn't get pulled into the garage with you, but he's still outside and you can see him on the radar, then you still want to do that step over. All right. The very next step we're going to do if we hit that step correctly is we're going to pull up behind our MOC and we're going to hit right D-pad. Now what should happen is we should get frozen. But if you get pulled into your MOC, then you guys want to just find a brand new session and start over. But if you did get frozen, what you want to do is have your friend open up his phone, go to play quick job, go down to activity, golf, start it up with friends in a session. He's going to get that alert message. That's OK. He just want to start it up again. So open up his phone, go to play quick job, activity, golf, friends in a session and start that up. Now we're just going to wait for that job to populate. And once that job is populated, we will be joining our friend through the party but we won't accept all of the alert messages, okay? So we're just gonna take our time with this glitch. We're not gonna move too fast thinking we know what to do. So we're just gonna wait for it to say populating like that. Now that that job is populating, I will get an alert message at the bottom of my screen as well, letting me know that that job is populating. So I'm just gonna join my friend through the party. I'm gonna select his name. I'm gonna select join session. And what's gonna happen is we're gonna get this black alert screen. We're gonna let our friend know and what our friend is going to now do is stop that activity from running. So he's going to open up his phone, go to play quick job activity and close his phone. Now what we're going to do is we're just going to accept this alert message. So accept the first alert message, accept the second alert message as well. And what should happen is we will go into the clouds and we will come back down. And when we do, our MOC will disappear. Now what we want to do is we want to wait for that message to disappear saying our MOC has been returned to the bunker. Once it does disappear, we're going to open up the interaction menu. We're going to go down to services and we're going to request our mobile operation center. Now, if you can't request your mobile operation center right now during this stage, that's OK. Don't worry about it. We can request it after the step that we're about to do. So, like I said, if you can't request your mobile operation center right now, 
do not worry just continue with the glitch and you will be able to request it after we do this step so from here what we're going to do is we're going to pull up to the garage we're going to select parking garage we're going to hit the ps button and then we're going to go back into the game and now we're frozen just like before so we just want to wait here for 45 seconds so tell your friend to start up a timer or you can start up a timer once the 45 seconds is up what your friend want to do is open up his phone and he want to start up a job from martin and once he starts that job up from martin we will eventually get pulled into the garage your friend is going to get pulled into the job and he will be glitched out for a moment but he will be able to back out eventually so tell him not to worry but what we're going to do is we're going to join a friend in a different targeting mode because we do have the infinite black loading screen and we're doing the double join method here we got the first alert message and we're now going to join our friend again and if he is in a different targeting mode then we will get that second alert message and we want to decline it from there we're just going to press options go to online criminal starter pack and back out just like before we're now underneath the map and we just want to wait for our character to get wasted all right just like that once we respawn we just want to make our way over to where our moc is my moc happens to be over here so i'm just going to run over here to my moc i'm going to have my friend pull the car around that he's going to give me so he's giving me this car right here the zion classic so once he pulls the car up we want to make sure that he doesn't have it too close to the moc so we can still see our blue circle and then from there he's going to stand by our moc and we're going to make sure that he is on our friends list so we can get to enter alone or enter with crew and friends we want that option now we're just going to select enter alone once we select enter alone we should be at an infinite black loading screen so what we're going to do is join a friend in a different targeting mode we're going to join him once and now we can double tap the ps button and it's going to take us right back to that screen so we can join him twice and what should happen is if he's in a different targeting mode we'll get that second alert message and we can just decline it now you should be invisible, but you want to quickly make your way over to that vehicle that we have parked nearby, hop inside of it, and you will get pulled into the MOC with it immediately. From there, the vehicle is now yours, and your friend will not lose this vehicle. I repeat, your friend will not lose this vehicle. As you can see, my friend still has the vehicle, and we now look like twins out here, all right? So this is how you do the brand new gift cards, the friends glitch, guys, the new workaround. If you guys like this video, please let me know down in the comment section below. Let's try to get this video up to 150 likes. I really appreciate all of the support. Thank you guys for helping me reach 6,000 subs as well. Go share this video with a friend. Please help me help you, you guys, and keep bringing you these great GTA 5 online videos. Until next time, this is your boy, Glitch Guru. Officially, you. Peace. Stay loyal.